Welcome back to President Trump News Channel. Please subscribe and check notification bell. Thanks for being with us. Identifying houses of worship. Trump threatens to override governors, even though he can't. President Trump told reporters at an impromptu White House briefing that he will override state governors if they didn't open places of worship this weekend. And mosques as essential places that provide essential services. Some governors have deemed liquor stores and abortion clinics as essential, but have left out churches and other houses of worship. It's not right. So I'm correcting this injustice and calling houses of worship essential. I call upon governors to allow our churches and places of worship to open right now. If there's any question, they're going to have to call me, but they're not going to be successful in that call. These are places that hold our society together and keep our people united. The people are demanding to go to church and synagogue, go to their mosque. Many millions of Americans embrace worship as an essential part of life. The ministers, pastors, rabbis, imams, and other faith leaders will make sure that their congregations are safe as they gather and pray. I know them well. They love their congregations. They love their people. They don't want anything bad to happen to them or to anybody else. The governors need to do the right thing and allow these very important essential places of faith to open right now for this weekend. If they don't do it, I will override the governors. He threatened to override those governors. However, President Trump does not have the legal authority to override governors. President Trump may not consider church essential to his personal life, but it may be to his political future. And so he waded into the culture wars on Friday by demanding that states allow places of worship to reopen right away and threatening to overrule any that defy him. Marching into the White House briefing room for a hastily called announcement, Mr. Trump declared places of worship essential operations that should hold services in person this weekend, regardless of state quarantine orders stemming from the coronavirus pandemic that has killed nearly 96,000 people in the United States. The governors need to do the right thing and allow these very important essential places of faith to open right now for this weekend Mr. Trump said, reading from a prepared text before leaving after just about a minute without taking questions. If they don't do it, I will override the governors. In America, we need more prayer, not less. The White House could not explain what power the president actually has to override the governors, and legal experts said he did not have such authority, but he could take states to court on religious freedom grounds, which could be time-consuming. Attorney General William P. Barr, a strong advocate of religious rights, has been threatening legal action against California 